Yeah, a verdict has uh, been reached in the trial of a La Mesa police officer who's accused of lying about a controversial arrest. Video of that arrest last year sparked protests in La Mesa with stores looted and banks burned. Fox 5's Jason Sloss joins us live from the East County with the jury's decision. Jason. Hey there. Well, the former officer would have faced up to three years in prison if convicted. Instead, he's free, and his attorneys say this is a case that should not have gone to trial to begin with. We, the jury in the above entitled cause, find the defendant, Matthew James Davis, not guilty of the crime. A jury finding former La Mesa police officer Matthew Degas not guilty of falsifying a police report following the arrest of Amari Johnson in May of last year. It was caught on cell phone video showing Degas contacting Johnson at the Grossmont trolley station, then grabbing and pushing Johnson down. The physical contact, along with the appearance of a white officer shoving a black man, led to protests and rioting in La Mesa as it happened around the time of the George Floyd incident in Minnesota. But the officer's actions were not on trial, rather the police report and the reasons given for contacting Johnson. Davis claims he went up to Johnson for being in a trolley fare zone without fare and also for smoking in public. Johnson testified he was waiting for friends at an apartment complex and was not even smoking at the time. Johnson testified he was confused and frustrated and when he asked to leave, the officer wouldn't let him. Johnson was arrested but never charged. Degas was eventually fired from the department. But after the verdict, Degas was outside the courthouse celebrating with family and well-wishers. Degas declined requests for an interview, but his attorneys did speak about the verdict. Defense attorney Joshua Visco said his client is relieved and that his report was accurate. Frankly, I'm still frustrated. Obviously, we're happy. We know that the jury did the right thing. We know that the system worked because it does work. But I'm frustrated because this was a political prosecution and it was wrong from the beginning. And a not guilty verdict shows that the district attorney should have never prosecuted this, play, this case in the first place. So what now for Degas? Well, his attorneys indicated he would fight to get his job back with La Mesa PD, says he still wants to be a police officer. Live in El Cajon, Jason Sloss, Fox 5 News.